For the most part, when I pack, I rarely forget anything <laughs> because I'm the person that like packs like two days in advance, even though we're only going to be gone for like a day and a half. My name is Latoya Sanders. I am the center for the Washington Mystics. Come on, here we go, Red. Here we go, two men. This is my 12th professional year, um, but I've been with the Mystics for five years. Previously, I played in Phoenix, LA, and Minnesota. Also, I played professionally overseas, and I've played in Italy, Russia. Uh, majority of my time has been in Turkey. When we go on the road, we don't pack too much because like, they carry our shoes, they carry our uniforms. Our season is about four and a half months without playoffs. Um, and we're usually just on the road half the time. I just try to bring things that make me feel comfortable on the road. When I am on the road with the Mystics, um, I usually pack some jeans just in case I go to a nice restaurant, some books to have some reading in the hotel room, my iPad, because maybe if I don't feel like reading, I can just catch up on TV shows, our travel sweats, soap, my iron pills, and my makeup remover cleansing face wipes, Bose headphones. I'm a very scared flyer, so any noise bothers me, so these work magic for me. When I do go overseas to stay comfortable, I do pack a, a coffee machine. <laughs> because, um, you know, everywhere you go, there's not like a, you know, a good local uh, coffee shop. So usually I do pack because I have to have my caffeine every day. Um, I take my Apple TV so I can keep up on all my American television. And I take two essential medical devices, which is the Hypervolt and the Mark Pro to help me stay healthy while overseas. I do take um, a silk pillowcase, whether I'm traveling with the Mystics or overseas, because I'm really picky when it comes to uh, my pillowcases. Can't have dry hair, so. <laughs> I'm um, picky on that. I do have to pack a little bit more when I go over to Turkey as they don't have the same uh, groceries that we have here in America. They don't eat pork in Turkey. So one of the weird things I pack, I usually take like a bunch of turkey bacon and I freeze it. And because it's obviously cold in the plane, by the time I get to my apartment um, in Turkey, it's still frozen. And then I pop it back in the freezer and use it as needed. <laughs> my life is pretty low key overseas. You know, when you have a language barrier and you know, not necessarily in your comfort zone. I tend to stay home and cook more, but it's, it's a fun country. I love to play there. It's my favorite place.